for this video, I have created a marble toilet tissue holder. And if you would love to see how it was created, stay tuned. Go ahead and click on that subscribe button and the bell so you can be notified of future uploads. Hello, lovies, and welcome back to Ladija's Creations. For this DIY, I'm getting ready to make a toilet tissue holder for the bathroom. It's going to be able to hold about five rolls of toilet tissue. And I'm going to be starting out with Dollar Tree foam board, in which case I have gone ahead and rolled it up. All I did was took a can and pretty much just rolled it like so. So now what I'm getting ready to do is to take some tape and I'm going to cut some pieces and I'm going to fold this over so that it will stay together put the can in there so it'll be easier As you can see here, I've taken and cut out two circles, one for the top and one for the bottom. And I have gone ahead and glued the bottom one on. And now I am just cutting the excess off of the circle. I have gone ahead and wrapped the marble contact paper around the toilet tissue holder. I glued one end of it down, but to close it up, I'm going to cut off about two inches of the protective paper and use the peel and stick side to actually close it up. I'm having to add an extra piece of the marble contact paper because the top piece was not long enough. And now I'm cutting strips of the contact paper to cover the one inch foam board that I'm placing around the edge of the top. I have covered the top with contact paper and now I'm getting ready to glue my edges on. And now that I've got my one inch strips of foam board glued on, I'm now taking the marble contact paper and I'm going to place it around the edges. And once I am done adding the contact paper around the edges, I am going to begin to cut slits into the contact paper so that it will lay down much more easier. I am now cutting off the excess marble contact paper from the bottom of the top. And once I am done with that, I will be done with my top. The next thing I'm getting ready to do is to take and mimic the holder at the bottom to make it kind of look like the top so that it won't look so plain. I'm going to be mimicking the top of this down here at the bottom. And I have gone ahead and cut out a one inch strip of foam board and I covered it with the marble contact paper. That is what it's looking like. And I'm just going to be gluing it around the bottom side down there so the bottom won't look so plain. I'm just adding the glue onto the one inch strip of foam board. And I am just adding that strip of foam board around the bottom side, having been glued. I'm going to continue to glue the one inch strip all the way around and place it around the edge of the holder at the bottom. I'm just adding some around the edges to seal the two pieces together as well. Now the bottom side is looking like the top side. 
it holds about five rolls. That's the first roll of tissue. That's the second roll, the third, the fourth, and the fifth roll. I will still have about that much room inside. That turned out beautifully. And now the bottom looks like the top. But lovies, it's time to go. I love you guys and I want you all to know that I'm always praying for you. And you know what my main prayer is, is that if you don't know Jesus as your personal Savior and your Lord, you will make him your personal Savior and your Lord today. And come on into the kingdom of God and begin to activate and demonstrate the kingdom of God that is within you. Luke chapter 17 verses 20 through 21.